I started working at the park uh, 25 years ago under my father's Surinder Paul and I started working with him as a marketing manager. After he uh, died um, suddenly in 1990, I was propelled into this role of managing three hotels. And my concern was how I could make these hotels distinctive and stand out in the marketplace. I'm proud that we've actually created a brand that reflects contemporary India. As we've grown over the years, I felt there was, this was now the time that we needed to communicate the strength of our brand in a more coherent manner. See, our company has a very strong and powerful vision that is leadership through differentiation. Park is redefining new luxury. And this redefinition of luxury is coming through design, it's uh, coming through entertainment, and it is coming through creation of unique service experiences. The atmosphere is very businesslike during the day. It is um, very cool, very relaxing, very sexy during the evening, and it is very pulsating in the night. This is the difference between the park and the rest of the hotels. The needs of the customer are changing. It means earlier the hotels used to be used only to come and sleep. Now the customers want to socialize, they want to network, they want to party. Park captures that. When a customer arrives till the time he leaves, hundreds of activities are performed. And when we do these activities from the heart, it leads to the creation of unique, engaging, and memorable customer experiences. The first time I came to India was in July 2009, and I was coming to India from Paris. I had been traveling around the world for the French Embassy and our network overseas. And I must say that it was like love at first sight with the park. Why is that? It's because I came here a little bit intimidated about India, I must say. So I was introduced to India through this modern version that park is bringing to the traveler. And I think that's very important for us. The us being French people. We are very inclined towards style and aesthetics um, in France, but all over Europe, I would assume. International hotels, and I've been lucky enough um, to travel a bit in the world um, are all the same. And here I was being introduced to India, but in a modern way, through art, food, culture, and manners. And that's the distinctiveness of the park that we really enjoy. Park Street had a magic and nothing really went wrong in a serious way. Audience, performers, there was cabaret, there was drag acts, there was, you know, nightlife. There was a sense of style. And then things went downhill because, mainly because, the real people who could make it happen, musicians, performers, audience, dancers, they did a mass exodus. And I meet the FNB manager of this hotel, Mr. Obajit Bose. And he says, I have this dream of bringing that style of life and music and entertainment back. You don't get to play live music and with people standing, no, no seats, and soaking it in. And I said to Mr. Bose, hire us. Why wait? And the rest is history, really. I mean, just about anybody who's anybody has played at this venue from around the country. This has to be in the woodwork and the walls and the flagstones of this street. I think it has done as much as a human being could have expected. I look forward to every night. I enjoy every stroke I play. This spa is my lifestyle now. It's not luxury anymore, it's like necessity. Aura, you know, aura for me is like um, invisible light which comes from within. And aura takes your negative energy out from your body and gives you the positive energy, I believe so. They use all those kind of ingredients which is very close to you. 
it's very nice you know those, those ingredients defines you maybe for face i really like this honey and milk you know it's like remembering my mother and she's like the closest person in my life so you know that smell you know i i feel nice you know when that uh, milk wala smell aata hai na i feel nice and you know, i feel like okay i'm with my mom so i can relax i can sleep and uh, the girls they have magic in their hands you know when you are going out from the spa you are smiling that's what you want in you know, the happiness so both gupta and i are currently working together on a project in hyderabad which is for the personal suites um a set of 14 suites where she's working with um designers and i think with the only artists um and it's a it's a suite that is our personal vision of the kind of room that we would like to live in um if we were to stay in a hotel you see when i when i went to the when i went to the hyderabad side when it was a building site it was really interesting because i think she, um the the people who are also working on the projects are equally excited by the fact that they're using um ruby dusted onyx and you know these amazing materials that have been handcrafted for themselves so as i was saying before the indigenous um materials and and the local crafts is something that's very important to her and this is uniquely indian anyway because this is the very seat of you know all great traditions of all the handmade they've got really eccentric unique um one off pieces that you don't see in other hotels priya always gets in young designers or people that she sees while she's traveling or why she's able to go to trunk shows and various other places and she'll invite them to come and do projects so um for some young designers and jewelry makers and these it's really the first place where they're at, actually able to show their their work i celebrate my son's homecoming here i spoke to chef mandar i wanted uh, a lot of uh, uh, hyderabadi touch to all the different kind of continent stuff he's going to make for us they really came out of quite a lot of ideas which are out of the box actually uh, i i planned something which is about 80 90% and i got 180% out of it i think the evening went on very very well and i could not have asked god for more there were things like croissant halwa there were things like kaddu ka kheer it's got a very different taste to it and it's nice it's smooth it melts it's like you have to have it to know it <laughs> for me the park uh did an excellent job with sort of recreating the whole Miami LA type boutique hotel type ethos Uh, but still within an Indian context. I remember the first time I came to Aqua, I was blown away and that's not a phrase that I use lightly. You can start off your night, you know, with a couple of uh, aperos and sort of start uh, just having a gentle drink or two. And then uh, if you haven't eaten, you can have a good meal at one of the restaurants. And then once you're done with the restaurant, you can actually go straight to a nightclub. So you've got sort of uh, a fully integrated going out entertainment option. So that's the really Uh, I think for me that's one of the best things about the park. Actually with the park you know we uh, uh, at, at DLF have had a very sort of I would call it a synergic relationship as far as our business needs are concerned and over a period of time you know as our company grew as um, I suppose Indian business grew our needs got larger and larger. We had uh, uh, conferences here which have been ranging from board meetings to offsite brainstorming sessions. which have been organized i think practically overnight actually because we had some uh, outside people attending and our facilities weren't large enough and i think as i said within a couple of hours the park was very responsive to our needs and they got everything organized the staff is very swift uh, responsive and very targeted to what we want and uh, um they are very flexible in their approach they are not rigid which as a, as as a company most people very often require a certain amount of flexibility and frankly we found all this and more from the park and it's been a wonderful experience the park is creative it's home vibrant rocking park is extraordinary constantly evolving dynamic anything but ordinary absolutely wild and wacky inspiring very inspiring my friends stylish indeed playful the park is buzzing fulfilling it's fun passionate Park is pre and post. Total creative freedom. Provocative. The park is contemporary. It's modern India. Bold. It's really bold. 